Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun. The last episode we got uh, an I this item right here, the Orb of Force, which we'll give to you and equip it. What does it do? Well, it teaches you the Synergy Force. Someone's giant fist to punch your enemies. It's kind of hilarious, actually. Anyway, we're going to set that to the... Actually, I should have set it to the R button, shouldn't I? Keep this set to... Uh, perfect. All right. So we're going to be using that a lot in the next dungeon. Yes. All right, come in here. Excellent, Trent. I am glad to see you master the secrets of Fuchin Temple. We monks call the power you have retained Qi, or Qi, or whatever, I don't care. You seem confused, Trent. Yes, I am very confused. This is called Force by the Western, but it really is a spiritual power. I will teach you as you promised. Use this power to go through the Force. What would happen if you let loose this energy in the Force? I have no idea. Ha! Ah, you're curious, no? Very! Monsters that wait in the hive den would show themselves. You would then try to defeat them, would you not? No. Haha, -ha, that is right. There is no good in long time destruction. Monsters are cowardly. They will run once they know you can see them. They are creatures of the woods, so they do not get lost there. Oh! Gimmick time! Use this energy to find the monsters and follow them. Which is that simple? Punch! Now that I have passed my knowledge of the healing, I am without worries. Farewell, Trent. Take care of yourself. And after this, he enters a state of meditation. Pretty much, and can never talk to him again. Or so I'm hurt. That's all I remember, because somehow he stays in hibernation for long enough to show up like 80 years later, totally fine. How did you get here? Was the bridge open again? Yep. Really? Then I can get home to Kalima now? I thought I'd never go home with the Cursed Forest and all. Alright, and now our next destination. Immediately south of us. Into the Mogul Forest. And in there jumps the thing. Now then, let's save just in case. And force. Said force. I follow himself. Let's read the sign first. The broken sign reads North, Kuchin Temple, South, Mogul Prairie. Same enemies! Blizzard! Yeah, just keep following the thing. Now then, I know that there's a Dijin in here, so... Well, let's see. Force! Nope! Wrong enemy. We'll have to just kill this one, then. Purple Slash! Ha! Anyway... These guys aren't that hard, but they can hit a lot. Uh, they can hit for a lot. They're really dodgy, too, apparently. And he's dead. Now then. Rolling puzzles. See, these are kind of simple, but there's a lot of them. And caught by surprise, great. Alright, let's just go all out with multi-hitting... Uh, spells. Plasma! But anyway... This voice is very simple once you know the trick. I have no idea what happens when you go down the wrong way. I'm going to assume that you head back to the very start. Somehow. So, uh... Yeah, we're good. Alright. Follow him to the right there. Let's keep going right. Ooh, flee! No. 
Dang it. Time to go all out then! And again, all out! There we go. Leveled up to 12. And he runs south. The other one is probably a trick, so we're not going to use it. Let's go south. I know. I keep saying that there's a Jinjin around here. I know there is. I just don't remember where. It's been a while, viewers. I'm sorry. Now that. Oh, there he is. Healing up, because it's always good to heal up after too many battles, viewers. Force! Hmm, why is this not working? Okay, uh... Hold on, viewers. Let's try force on this one! No. What am I doing wrong? Oh, I can go around this way, can't I? Yes, I can. Okay, then. Or not. A bit too far to move it. Shouldn't be able to force it either. Oh wait, I'm stupid. Why? why? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm really stupid, viewers. I'm sorry. Sorry that you had to be prone to that stupocracy. There we go. Now then, more rolling puzzles. More battles. Let's run. This and push this. Push this over to this way. Freeze the game because we're going to fight a Dijin now. Now then, when the Dijin run away, you can encounter them in the same area, but you have to leave the room first. This is the reason why I do not. Uh, that's why I always save. Gust! Hiya! And it uses Earthquake on us. Fantastic! Flint! Sweet! Fever! Let's uh, actually heal up a little bit. And actually, you set to your thing. Grab it! Alright, now, uh, let's just summon rush with these guys. Just in case a gust doesn't kill him. Gust! Sweet! We got extra money and extra experience points because of that. That was awesome. And we got Quartz! Who revives a downed ally. Which is not as nice as it seems, sounds, because it's like a very low percentage, like 30 I think? I don't remember. It's really low. Anyway. Force! He pops out of that and goes to the other one. So we run around here. Fast forward run. And hit that. Now, I think this is all mandatory for you to do, because, well... Well, what do you think, viewers? It's the boss creature. If I'm not mistaken. Ah, oh, sweet! Caleb got... his class move! The heat wave. You see, the fighter classes each have their own special ability. Like... Like heat wave. They're all tied to their element, and each cla fighter class, if I'm not mistaken, has their own ability. I'm not 
exactly sure on that, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. Anyway, I'll just punch this one. South. Fantastic. Alright. Earthquake. Tundra. Let us show off heat wave. And plasma. Let's not show off heat wave, because they're all dead. And Ray got a useless spell sleep. Totally useless. I don't use it, that's why it's useless. Perfect. Okay, moving on. Yeah, this is how I normally do things, Vera, is I usually set them to the L and R buttons and then just move and stuff and switch them as I see fit, because it's easier to push a button than to go through a menu every single time. It jumps down to the bottom one, so we'll have to go around and get him. Puzzles! Monsters! Oh, we, we attack first! Rumble Slash! Save the tail! I hit you with my axe! Poor Caleb, he doesn't have a legend, uh, rare item. Oh well. I forgot that you go out a whole game without, like, getting anything from him. Push this over here, and, as usual, force! Pounce! And he runs to the south. All right, now down here. Down here, let's freeze. Did you hear that? Something came out. Well, let's just keep going without uh, doing anything, huh? Uh-oh. That does not sound good. Oh god! It's a giant ape! Anyway, Flint! Uh, Sweet! Fever! And Zephyr! Use Zephyr, for the love of god, this thing is way too fast without it. He doubles your agility! Which is fantastic! He's weak to fire, so keep using fire abilities. Credit! Dust! Ow. Fizz! Forge! Alright, perfect. Now then, let's just use quartz. Summon Nerid! Summon Kirin! And Breeze! Breeze! Quartz! Ow! Nerid! Kirin! This guy can be kinda hard if you don't pay any attention, so... Let's use our two new summons, Cybel and Procney. Use Ply on you. Cast Heat Wave! Heat Procney! Giant Bird! Cybel! Giant Bulbasaur thing! Use wave! 
beautiful. And we got restore for her. And the douse drop. That is amazing. Give it to her. You can give it to anyone, but I love giving it to her. Now she knows the douse spell. And there are a few puzzles back at the beginning of the game that use douse, so... We'll have to go back and get them. Not now, though. It's a bit too late for that. Now then, here! Ah. We fight apes in the wild! So we'll just kill them? I said kill them, not kill me. Man, that was a lot of HP. I didn't mean to run. Okay. Now then, this location right here, if I can get this to work, uh, I think it is the dash button. Well, let's quickly freeze frame. We go to the north here of this town, towards this forest. Let's heal up a little bit. Keep going north, and around here you will fight. These enemies! No, not what I wanted to fight. Let's keep going north. Right here, if I'm not mistaken, is your first instance of a Dinjin on the world map. Now, in the first game, there's only like three. Only three on the world map. If I'm not mistaken, yes, only like three. Four, three. In the next game, there are more than three. <laughs> there are quite a lot, actually, if I'm not mistaken. But that is neither here nor there for now. Fire! Wheat to water, obviously. So let's just go all out! Zephyr! Ow! Flint! Sleep! Forge! Now then, just attack with you. And you use fever and gust. Gust! Please! Fireball! Ow, that really freaking hurt! Now he's dead, though. Kind of like that. You're dead. And now you're a part of us! My thirst, Mudge Jin! Corona! Which. Increases our defense, which is fantastic. Uh, hold on. There we go. Setting all of them. Now then, let's go back south to that town! But we're not going to investigate the town. Because we're dying. That's why. No. Because once we enter this town... If you can ever enter the town, that'd be great. Let me enter the town. Enter the town. We have Zion! And here we shall end the episode. This is Parnash, signing off. Have a good day, viewers!